Hi there, it's Nick Gregan from Very Easy Photography. As you can see for this shot, I used a clear Perspex backdrop. And I've shot this on F4, quite a narrow depth of field. And there's the resulting shot. So I've tried it with a black background, and we'll see how that goes. As you can see from this setup, I'm using clear Perspex as a side light to diffuse the side light. Now it's just clear Perspex from the top of a packing case, so nothing uh, particularly special, and a bit of black foam core board that I have around the studio. Quite a different feel with them now, as I'm just playing on with the light and trying to get rid of those shadows in the backdrop, those distracting shadows. And as you can see, it's a lovely gorgeous day with the blackbirds singing in the background. And now I've brought another piece of foam core. Nothing special. Just bodged it by standing them on um, plant pots. And as you can see, there's gaps in the corner there. And that streak of light in the background. Just kissing the top of the flower. I'm not really super keen on that. And then there's the next shot. I brought in a little LED light, this tiny little LED light, it worked really, really well. And then I flipped to another garden tray that I use in the garden, and you can see how mangy it is, stood on plant pots. And there's the result. I prefer it against a black backdrop, but that's not too bad. Then for a bit of fun, I put the camera on a tripod and tried it with uh, a slow shutter speed. And this is what you get to see with a slow shutter speed. Just something different. A nice way to while away and have fun for about an hour in the garden. Hope you found this reasonably interesting. Uh, this is Nick Gregan from Very Easy Photography. And if you want to look for some more information, www.veryeasyphotography.com.